Hi, I'm Steve Rhodes and welcome to the Wood Burning Studio. I'm here today to tell you about the WAM Autopilot. The WAM Autopilot is like cruise control for your wood stove or fireplace. The Autopilot promotes complete combustion. Complete combustion means saving 30% on your wood supply, a cleaner chimney, and reducing air pollution, even if you're not an experienced wood stove user. WAM has been making fireplaces and wood stoves in Denmark for over 40 years, and the Autopilot is on every wood stove and fireplace they make. So how does this device accomplish these things? Well, modern wood stoves and fireplaces have three sources of combustion air, primary air, secondary air, and air wash air. The autopilot controls all three of these air sources automatically and simultaneously. Wom wood stoves and fireplaces are the only ones on the market that have the autopilot or anything like it. So this is the control panel that you'll find on the back of every WAM wood stove. The primary air enters here, the secondary air enters here, and the air wash air enters here. Now the autopilot is controlled by a thermostatic spring inside the combustion chamber. This spring measures combustion temperature. Now as this spring heats up, it will begin to expand and rotate and when it does, it will move these control arms and gate valves on the back of the stove. Now the goal here is to achieve the perfect combustion temperatures and air quantities for each phase of combustion according to the heat level that's been selected by the user. So after the stove has been running for a few minutes, the user can select the heat level using the control in the front of the stove and the autopilot will take over from there. Now, we're going to use this torch to simulate the heat of the combustion chamber. And this is going to heat up a lot faster than it would in your wood stove, but we're going to save a little bit of time here. We're going to aim this right at the spring. Now, during the beginning of the combustion process, only the primary air source is open. The secondary is closed because there are no wood gases present at this time. And the air wash air is open. Now the air wash air is open now because at the beginning of the fire, the stove tends to be a bit smoky and that helps keep the glass clean. And this is true of any wood stove or fireplace at the start of the combustion process. Now as this heats up, you're going to see this lever start to come around and it's beginning to close off the primary air supply. We're going to give it a little more juice here. And it's beginning to close the air wash air and beginning to close the primary air. And soon you're going to see the secondary air start to open up. Now when the stove heats up, the draft increases. So that's one reason why you want to cut down on the primary air because you have more air moving through that opening. Now here you can see the secondary is starting to open and the air wash air is pretty much closed up at this point. Now one thing I want to note is that when the stove is hot, you don't need as much air wash air to keep the glass clean and that's why that valve begins to close. So remember, complete combustion means saving 30% on your wood supply, having a cleaner chimney, reducing air pollution. It also means you don't have to spend a lot of time adjusting your wood stove. Just set the heat level desired using the control on the front of the stove, and the autopilot does the rest. Just set it, forget it, and start saving money. If you'd like to find out more about the autopilot or see the independent test results, please visit us at www.womna.com. And thanks again for joining us at the Wood Burning Studio.